Hey, this is Mark from the 2019 Motor City Comic Con. I'm here with writer, illustrator, Gene Ha. How you doing? I'm doing okay. So you have this new graphic novel out called May. Tell us a little bit about that. It's a, a book I write and draw. Uh, I've spent most of my career in comics uh, drawing superhero books, but I wanted to do something where I could tell the story the way I wanted to tell it. There are two sisters from rural Indiana. The older sister, Abby, uh, disappeared for, without a trace about seven or eight years before the story started. Uh, there's no note, so nobody knows what happened. So all this time, uh, the younger sister, May, has been worrying about where her sister disappeared. She's been taking care of her aging dad. And then a little bit after she gets out of high school, she gets a call from the sheriff's office late at night saying they found her sister. So she goes over there and her sister's wearing a crazy costume and has this tale about how she's been on another world, like John Carter or Dorothy. But in her case, she's been fighting against mad scientists and monsters and leading a tribe barbarian warrior cats into battle, which is a little bit much for May to believe up until some of the monsters follow her back. And this is how the younger sister, May, gets dragged into her sister's adventures on another world. So you used to do work for Marvel and DC, correct? Okay. okay. Why did you want to branch off on your own to do your own stuff? There's a thing where like, uh, I, I really admire the writers at Marvel and DC who can keep up with all the different crossover events and dictums and all that type of stuff and just jumping through the corporate hoops, but I couldn't do that. If I wanted to tell a story, it was going to be my own story in my own way without having somebody tell me, oh yeah, your secondary character, they, yeah, they're going to have to die this crossover or um, yeah, you're going to have to have a crossover with uh, Ambush Bug this episode. You know, I just... The stuff that the writers go through requires so much patience and diligence and just, I, I didn't want to write a story like that. That's why I did it this way. So what does the future hold for Gene Ha? Huh? I am going to be continue to do small pieces occasionally for other publishers, like uh, I have an unannounced short story I'm going to be doing with Marvel in a painted style, but that's all I can tell you. It's the rest is top secret. But other than that, I'm going to be uh, getting ready for the next volume of May. Uh, the second volume is coming out in September in comic shops. Okay, everyone, look out for the next volume of this book. It looks really cool. And this is Mark from the Motor City Comic Con. We'll see you next time.